Hello, Southa, and welcome back to Focal News SA. So today we're talking about Mzwanele Mani, an next key figure in the EFF, who's facing some serious accusations about where his two loyalties lie. Let's follow up, shall we? Well, by now you know that Mani and the party's deputy president, Floyd Shivambu, announced their departures from the EFF on Thursday. But while they are yet to disclose what informed their move to leave the EFF, the MK party said it had welcomed them with open arms. But honestly, Floyd Shivambu's move caught everybody by surprise. A next user who goes by the name Shaded Black said, As an MK party member, my heart sank for Julius Malema. While I'm welcoming and excited for Floyd Shivambu in the MK party, I'm heartbroken for the EFF. Mzwanele Mani was never a surprise. We need a strong EFF and MK. For now, the fighters rise. And speaking of Mani, this brings us to the main topic of today's video. As I said, people are really questioning where Mani's loyalties really lie. I mean, in the last five years, Mani has been a member of the African National Congress, the ANC, African Transformation Movement, the ATM, EFF, and he has now joined the eight-month-old MK party. Now, this might seem like a small thing, but in the world of politics, loyalty is everything. Uh, the, 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 the EFF and the MK party subscribe to pretty much the same kinds of things. As I said, the difference are points of emphasis here and there. I'm not here criticizing the EFF or anything, but I just think uh, Mr. MK party yeah. is my natural home. Yeah. And I don't think Jacob Zuma fumbled when it comes to money. But as for Julius Malema, their relationship was skating on thin ice. When did money resign? Monday, this Monday. Yeah, Monday. But even before he left, he sent me a message saying he wants to see me. He asked for an appointment through the SG and the SG is not acting on that appointment. So he's coming directly to ask me for a meeting. I referred back the communication to SG and SG's response was very simple. He's leaving. So <laughs> he's going to MK. So what meeting for what? Because he's leaving. Why must we have a meeting? He's leaving. So he wants me to call you to come and tell you that he's leaving. He's leaving. Now coming back to Twitter, a user by the name Lungisin Changase also questioned Mani's loyalties, questioning whether Mzwanele Mani truly voted for the EFF during the national elections. Another user jumped in the fray, suggesting that Mani's loyalty, whether to the EFF or any organization, might not be as rock solid as we thought. It doesn't matter what you do, people will speak, so they're, put, uh, they're entitled to their opinion, we respect their opinion. And now we have to remember that these are just opinions flying around on social media, but they are gaining traction. And when that happens, public figures like Mani start to feel the heat. So what do you think? Is Mani's loyalty being unfairly questioned? Drop your thoughts in the comments below and make sure to subscribe to Focal News Essay. Until next time. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.